Enchanté, enchanté, beautiful people. Mwah, hello, welcome, welcome back, welcome back to this beautiful, beautiful Sunday, Sunday in Portland, Oregon. And baby, you are with the Trent, baby, 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 Mwah! baby cakes. You are well. The restaurant was open, and the wait. The search is over, love was with you. Oh, wait, no. The search is over, love was with me all the while. Yes, we are finally going to review a place that Dr. Shenson own. Dr. Shenson and every other single person that I have spoke to loves. And I have been here. We are doing a dish. We are reviewing a dish that I have not had. Uh, but I have been here and I like it very much. In fact, I love it. It is a place. Here's the surprise. It is a Thai restaurant in Portland, Oregon, and baby, it is called Erewhon. Erewhon. It's one of my, one of my new favorite go-to places. I have, um, taken La Charie and even La Charie loves it. So, even La Charie, he didn't have a criticism of it. So, well, we're going to review a new dish. Maybe we'll find a criticism with this. I have not had this. I will tell you what it is. And uh, we will review it. Also, we are going to review what the lovely Miss Jenny gave me, who is a very, very nice server there, which is uh, a coffee that they gave me. And uh, we are going to review today. This is their menu that I did not steal. I know many of you think that I steal the menus when I go in there but I did not steal this menu. So what we're gonna review before we start talking, I got a Thai iced coffee right there with a nice photograph mem nice photograph photo there. And as I hit the top of the Jeep, and we are gonna do a salad roll. We're gonna review a salad roll, and which is a salad roll with shrimp and a vegetable served with a peanut sauce you had me at peanut sauce and also we're going to do number 31 which is a gang cow juan which is green curry with coconut milk bamboo shoots basil and bell pepper and chicken we're going to review that sounds delicious doesn't it baby sounds delicious just like you so that is what we are going to review how was everybody's thanksgiving by the way mine was quite Delightful. It was. It was low key with La Cherie. We had a nice uh, Thanksgiving. Food was food was okay. Food was good. Um, was it? Yeah, the turkey was good. As you know, it was Popeye's turkey. Um, and uh, yeah, it was. It was. It was good. Yeah. Yeah. You know, uh, I'm not. I, I love the idea of like holiday dinners and then when I actually have them I'm like mm, mm, you know I don't know if it's because I'm not like the hugest meat eater and then when I have it I'm like mm, you know um, but it was good yeah it was good I don't I don't really love the heaviness of like you know the heavy gravies and the stuffing I and like when I don't have it I get like anticipated. I like get excited about it, and then when I like like three bites in, I'm like, mm, uh, what am I doing? You know. So, some people love that 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 richness and intensity of it. Uh, <laughs> gonna be honest with you, that that banquet TV dinner, that I kind of prefer that. You know. And those of you that haven't seen that review, go back and watch that that banquet TV dinner. And I want to talk about that. Uh, I went back and went back and saw Paula, by the way. If you haven't watched my Banquet TV uh, dinner review, that's my last video. Go back and check that out and see what I thought of that. I won't give you all the details. You have to go back and watch that. So, yeah. So, let me know how your guys' Thanksgiving was. I hope it was excellent. I'm sure it was. But we've got some Thai food here. So, check this out. Erewhon is really good. It's on 82nd Avenue 
here in Portland, Oregon. And um, it was initially recommended to me by Dr. Shenson for a place to check out. He had actually thought that when I did a Thai video here a few weeks ago, that that was this place, right, that I had gone to. And then I saw him and he said, oh, you're, the place I'm thinking of is a different place on 82nd Avenue that you should check out that I think you'd like. And so I, I wanted, I went and checked this place out kind of on my own and absolutely loved it. And then when I talked to people, they were like, have you ever checked Erewhon out? Erewhon, Erewhon. And I'm like, God, enough with the Erewhon. And then I checked it out uh, and I realized why it was so good. I realized why people loved it. So, yeah. So, anyway, check these out. Here are the shrimp salad roll. Let's get a look at these. Very nice looking. Wrapped tightly, yet ever so gently. Ever so gently. Peanut sauce. Let's give these a slight taste here. I like peanut sauce very much. Sometimes, sometimes it tastes a little bit like too much like peanut sauce out of a jar, and I don't like that. You know, let's taste this peanut sauce on its own, shall we? Indulge just on its own, baby, just on its own. Cheers. Oh yeah, that's 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 really nice. A little bit of spice to it. A little bit of heat to it. Oh yeah, there is. Taste this with the salad roll. We're indulging here. Dipping gently and softly. Gently and softly. Mm. Mm, very nice. Very fresh tasting. Did Miss Jenny not give me any napkins? I like a napkin. Oh yes, you did. Very nice. Jenny was very thoughtful. I never want my compliments. <clears throat> a bit of a criticism on the salad roll. I wish that they would cut these like in half on these. Um, in the future, I wish that they would do that. I guess I could easily do that here. But I, um, that's my only criticism. Those are delicious. Those are absolutely delicious. Fantastic. Magnifico. Excellent. Very good. Uh, the, 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 um, the vegetable in that tasted very fresh. The shrimp tasted very on point. Not too overcooked. Definitely not rubbery. Definitely not rubbery at all. So, the coffee here. I had never had a Thai iced coffee before. This was compliments of Jenny. So, thank you again for this. Um, it has a very, it's a, it's a very sweet, it's a very sweet coffee. If you're not really into sweet, this might not be for you. It's a sweet cream, which I like very much. It has that, that kind of, it's got a unique taste to it. I think it's delicious, to be honest with you. Um, I had drank a little bit of it, so the before I did the review here. So the cream, this was more of like a white around here, kind of looking like um, uh, a white Russian drink, you know, when they first serve it to you. Um, but I think it's delicious. 
So, anyway, I want to tell you this quick story before we do the, the curry. So, anyway, by the way, a little update on the braces. Did I tell you, and I think I have, I get the braces off on the 18th of December. Reservations. I've had these for so long, going on close to what, four years now. I don't know how I'm going to feel with my braces off. I don't know how I'm going to deal with that. Uh, weird, probably. And I'm selling my braces too, by the way. So, <clears throat> nobody wants to buy those, though. But, you know. Um, so I just want to tell you that I'm slightly excited about the 18th, but I'm also slightly apprehensive because it's been, a, I mean, when good old Smokey, when good old Joe, um, Joe Biden first got into office, I got my braces on. So, um, and um, yeah, so that was four years ago. So yeah. Wow, man. Crazy. Crazy. So yeah. Anyway, enough with that. That's just a stupid story. I want to tell you a, 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 a kind of a very funny story, but also kind of an irritating story. So anyway, I um, a couple days after Thanksgiving, right, I thought, I'm going to go up and tell Paula, because Paula was the lady that helped me with the banquet. And again, go back, watch the video, so you get kind of the gist of where I'm going with the story. For those of you that watch that video, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Paula Hank helped me with the banquet TV dinner. Paula was a trip, right? Yeah. So anyway, I'm like, I got to go back up there. I got to go to the grocery store and tell Paula how I felt about the banquet TV dinner and, you know, keep, keep the jokes going with Paula, right? So anyway, I go into the grocery store and I'm looking around, right, you know, and you guys know how much I love music, right, so I'm looking around for Paula, and I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing her, I go back to where the grocery, where the frozen food area was, I don't see her, and I'm like, what the hell, where's Paula, go back over to the fruits and vegetables, she's not there either, I'm thinking, oh, come on. Go back over to the frozen department. There she is. There's Paula. So I'm just like, hey, okay, because I know that some of you, you got to know this song. Those of you that are old enough to know this kind of music, and those of you that know me on here, you know the kind of music, you know what I'm going to do, right? You know it's coming, right? You know that it's coming. I see her, and I'm like, Hey, hey, Paula, I want to marry you. Hey, hey, Paula, right? And here she is. So I'm like, what are you doing, Paula? And again, hey, hey, Paula, respond, respond. And she's like, Come on, Paula. Hey, hey, Paula. You're supposed to go. Hey, hey, Paul. I want to marry you. Am I, am, I, am I clinically insane? If your name is Paula and you're like 100 years old, don't you know that song? How do you not know that song? How do you not know Hey, Hey, Paula? That's like the most iconic song if your name is Paula. If your name is Paula. How do you not know that song? Oh! And I'm like, third time. Come on, Paula. Come on. Hey, hey, Paula. I want to marry you. And then I'm like, literally say to her, come on, Paula. Give it back to me, baby. Give it... Thrusting, releasing, thrusting, releasing. Give it back to me, baby. And she's like, I'm married. Choking myself out. 
then releasing, then back to choking, then releasing. I'm literally doing this in front of Paula. And I'm like, Paula, it's a song, Paula. It's a song you're just supposed to say. Hey, 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 Paul, I want to marry you too. That's all you're supposed to say. It's comedy. It's comedy, Paula. It's comedy. Because, you know, you feel like saying, not meant for kids. Like you got a fucking chance, Paula. Really? Really? You're 80 years old. It's a song. So, anyway, I just sort of was like, hey, just wanted to let you know that um, the TV dinner was great, Paula. The TV dinner was great. And she's, again, I don't know, I, I, again, with the chin. Oh, that's good. And I'm like, jazz hands in the air, in the air, you know, choking myself out again in front of her. No reaction, by the way, to that. No reaction. Usually when you see a man, an adult man, choking himself out in front of you, there's usually, I don't know, call me crazy, a response. I digress. So I tried to tell Paula how great the banquet was. Um, I find myself losing my mind around Paula. Hmm, interesting. Uh, anywho, shall we get to the curries? Shall we get to the curries? In case you're wondering, do I need to be institutionalized? The answer is yes. Oh, and also, if you haven't, would you please like and subscribe to the channel, please? You know what I'm not going to miss? I'm not going to miss, like, constantly having stuff in my, in my braces. Like, it's impossible to eat, like, a salad roll and not, like, have the entire amount just, like, that's what I'm not going to miss. I'm not going to miss having the salad roll all up, all up in arms. So, all right. So, we have a plate here. I don't know where the hell, hell that came from. We have a spoon here, but we're going to put a little rice on this. Yeah, pa Paula seems to really get under, uh, under my thumb. The girl who has just had her day. I don't know, she seems like a relatively boring lady, to be honest with you, with no sense of humor. Oh, hello, baby. Lady getting on the bus in front of me. Now the bus driver's like smiling at me and nodding. Interesting. We're putting a little bit of rice. Wow, this is an insane video. This might, might be one of the most insane videos I've ever done. I haven't lost my mind officially today. I think it's because the sun is out and I'm in really a good mood today. But I'm normally in a good mood, but I just... The sun is out and um, I guess I'm just happy to see you. I'm happy to, always happy to spend time with you. And I was really happy that they were open. I should have went back and asked them, how come you guys were closed? So, anyway, so we got the green curry sauce. Green eyed lady, lovely lady. But you know what? I absolutely love that song, Hey Paula. Oh, love that song. Hey, hey, Paula. I've been waiting for you. Hey, 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 Paula. Nobody else will ever do. Don't you love that song? Do you guys even remember? To, I know that some of you, Deborah, 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 you and Frank love both of you, by the way. All chante to both of you guys. Hope you're doing well. Do you guys remember that song? 
I know that some of you guys have to on, on here remember it. Okay, this is a little bit, I have not had this, a little bit basic here. Okay, this, the, this is the, I put a little white rice down here on the plate. A little bit ever so gently, right? Sun's getting bright here. This, this green um, is a little bit basic. It's a coconut bamboo shoot with... The um, with with chicken. So put a little bamboo shoot on here. I had the Penang curry the last time, and I really like that. This is a little seems a little bit basic, but I don't know what. I guess I was. Was I expecting a red, more like red pepper? Isn't there supposed, oh, there is supposed to be red pepper. There's red pepper at the bottom here that I'm not, that I need to put on here. Yeah, there we, there we go. I was expecting a little bit more red pepper on that. On that, ladies and gentlemen. Bit of rice. Ever so gently set that down there and we will begin the begin when they begin the begin all right man it is getting bright here sorry guys shall we we've got here we are let me go over the details again we have the green curry with coconut milk bamboo shoots basil and bell peppers from Erewhon. Let's indulge, baby. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. Nice flavor. Oh yeah, that is a very nice flavor on that. You can taste, you can definitely taste the basil in that. A very, very much so. Difficult to eat this with a spoon, actually. The rice is cooked perfectly. Perfectly and beautifully. Very nice. The bamboo shoots are nice. The basil tastes very fresh. So does the rice. The coconut milk, nothing. See, everything just tastes, all the flavors are wonderful. Marry together very, very well. Yeah. Very nice together. A little bit of heat. <clears throat> a little bit of heat on that is really good. Yeah. Mm hmm. I like that. Mm. That is good. I'm a really big curry fan. I love curry. That's, a, that's an interesting curry. I, I don't know. I don't think I've ever had it with a basil like that. And the basil is very, is very pronounced. And I love basil. You know, I love cooking with basil. I love when I make a marinara sauce. I put in ample amounts of basil in it. And I really like that. So, yeah, very nice. Um, Erewhon, on a scale of 1 to 10, Mia Malkova, 
being a 10. One being absolute lowest of likelihood that I would ever order it again. I'm trying to get out of the shadows here, guys. Sorry. Um, let's see if I can get something here. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give you a solid, as far as Thai food goes, probably what I've had from you guys, probably would I say it's the best Thai food that I've ever had in my life? Probably I would. I am going to give you on a scale of 1 to 10, from everything that I've had from you, I'm going to give you a 10. I am. Um, the salad roll, 10. The, the green curry, the rice, I'm going to give you a 10. If you are in Portland, Oregon, I highly suggest that you try Erewhon. There is also one in Vancouver, Washington. I have not tried that one. My assumption is that it's probably going to be um, equally as good. But this location, the wait staff, everything in there is is magnifique. They also, what I haven't, what I didn't, what I neglected to meant to to get, and I wish I would have, is they also make their own sauces there. They make their own hot sauce. They make their own um, different uh, spices and sauces that you also can put on on your curry for heat levels and things like that. So, I would definitely recommend coming to Erewhon. Dr. Shenson, thank you so much for recommending and turning me on to this place. I, I really, I really appreciate it. And um, again, I highly recommend you coming to Erewhon, checking them out, um, showing them your support, and and trying out if if especially if you are a Thai food fan like myself. So absolutely. So ladies and gentlemen, this is another review in the books. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. Um, I guess I will see you again on Wednesday. So looking very forward to it. Hope you have an excellent rest of the week. And I will see your beautiful faces on Wednesday. Like the great Elvis Presley said in 1977 at his last concert. We will meet you again. May God bless you. Adios. And I love you. The Trent loves you, baby. Adios. Enchanté.